The tip we received was horrific. Had a baby died on New Year's Day because nobody answered the frantic and repeated 911 calls? The baby's death was just one example Sun Sentinel reporters revealed in a year-long investigation of Broward County's dangerously understaffed 911 centers. Fire destroyed a woman's house, even though her neighbors ran to a nearby station to alert firefighters in person. A woman who died, although her husband, a law enforcement officer in Miami-Dade County, called his own peers to get emergency help. And there were others. We revealed that 911 centers lost recruits shortly after training because they could get higher paying jobs at other call centers. We discovered that some employees worked so much overtime that they actually doubled their annual salaries. With each story, we kept asking, how long will the county and the sheriff allow this to continue? County commissioners claimed they had no idea the system for which they were responsible was so dangerously broken until the Sun Sentinel's investigation. After the series, they rushed to boost the salaries the sheriff said he needed to recruit and retain quality workers. Thank you for recognizing the Sun Sentinel's work on this investigation.